Um, and good day from my side. Um, I'm Johannes. I'm founder CEO at Solutic. Um, and I'm very happy today to stand here um, and talk with you about the way on our journey, how we connect value chains with data to overcome industry challenges. And let's see, uh, maybe we discover some potential to cooperate. The solar industry is facing significant challenges. And one is the fast growing complexity. Formerly, simple electricity consumers become sophisticated prosumers. And the consumption evolves into smart energy homeowners with production, consumption, storage, charging, heat, and we already observe what's next. And at the very same time, the market is experiencing accelerated growth that is creating an overwhelming global demand. And all of this complexity is still just half of the challenge. The second half are market inefficiencies, and they are holding back the entire industry. From a centralized utility environment, the energy, transform, the energy transition shifts the ownership into decentralized residential homeowners, and they are representing 99% of future decision makers. And in fact, today already, most decision makers are non-professionals, and those rely on the support from trained experts. The challenge here is that the professional market is not prepared for such high demand. And that shows in a scarcity in service in the first place, but also in excessive prices. The result of all this is quite devastating, because people are losing money. And a lot of the potential behind the energy transition is lost. If you are a residential PV investor, you're likely losing 23% of your profits unknowingly. And that's because once the installation has been installed, Investors like you and I tend to forget about it, while professional supervision is being blocked by the complexity of data and the market inefficiencies. So this little case study here illustrates a series of events and incidents along the life cycle of 25 years that add up to a significant loss. So the question is, how can we prevent losing money? Professional supervision is important. To counter these challenges of the market, we developed a market-leading data aggregation infrastructure that is brand and technology agnostic. And we are processing terabytes of hardware agnostic data every day already. The cleaned and aggregated data we're presenting to the decision makers, the installers and homeowners via a web interface, our monitoring solution. And now we are also launching our public GraphQL API that gives full data access to our customers, but also enables advanced, sophisticated enterprise integrations. With our monitoring solution, installers can supervise large portfolios of highest diversity. But we don't stop there. We also connect stakeholders along the value chain. The whole value creation starts with the professional monitoring, and then we decrease market inefficiencies for installers and homeowners. So the value chain from data collection to decision making is finally connected. And as you can see so far, we've been focused very much on the service value chain. Moving forward, we want to connect all value chains. So that's why we take the next big step now. So allow me to introduce you to Solar OS, a collaboration platform for solar-focused software companies. Together with Quest, a software solution for installation excellence, we are automating value chains along the life cycle for PV. Because small and medium-sized enterprises, installers, they have to compete nowadays with fast-growing and well-funded powerhouses. And tens of thousands of these installers want to stay independent from aggregator platforms. SolarOS is their way forward. Because with SolarOS, we are connecting data, we are decreasing complexity, we are increasing efficiency to install faster and service better. And we will open our lines to further partners. Last time I was standing here, um, I had very different funding plans, so if you check it out on YouTube, um, because we changed the trajectory of our company. We will have our first break-even year in company history this year. So this allows us to first celebrate, 
And second, it also allows us to focus this year on validating for the growth hypothesis. So we want to consider raising growth capital next year. So if you find we have a match as a customer, as a partner, or as an investor, um, I warmly welcome you to have a chat with me. And then let's work together towards a sustainable future. Thank you.